Good morning, everyone. A quick, a quick scenario we are having on AUD USD, and if you remember during the course of last week trading session, I shared um, a perspective into the expectation of a bullish momentum that is unfolding during the course of last week trading session, and it appears prices actually begin to evolve into that momentum that we are looking for. I will share I will share the link to the previous video in the comment section below so that we can actually look at it and have a better perspective into what was I was discussing. The first and first I noticed during the during the last week trading session was that um, we had a strong key level at 0.74250, and which one, the first one happened at the beginning of the month of March here, where we had a sharp rejection of that level. And um, which was later followed at the middle, some somewhere around the middle of the month, with a significant breakout, which saw price move um, almost, um, I think, to a, a 50 to 200 pips there about. And price has actually doing a retracement into that same level, though it broke that level and shared a confluence with um, the trend line, the bullish trend line we identified on the daily time frame so with this bullish trend line that we've seen here this will be a guide for us to into taking further opportunity on this trade as you can see the, we had increase um, pivot lows and though we didn't have a touch of this and then that's that signifies that um, um, the bullish momentum might be very very strong as time goes by so what i'll be looking for is this what i did initially was that i placed a a pending order at 0.740600 um earlier this morning before i actually posted any video and um, this trade has been triggered and i'm running with um about um about 40 pips thereabout however um, for those who are not yet in this trade, there is still an opportunity for us to take advantage of. So in this regard, we want to scale down to a much lower time frame so we can actually find out how we could take advantage of this. But before we do, we want to notice that um, there is a level here at 0.73650 thereabout where we've been having significant rejection by buyers, which actually gives that area a much more um, comfortable area for buyers to, to take advantage of, as you can see. And now we are right at that, at that area. And because of this consistent pressure from this 0.74 area, I identified a, a demand zone on that area, which will look something like this. So in this regard, um, the new demand zone for bullish momentum is going to be around this area. So if we move down to a much lower time frame, that is the one hour time frame, we want to look for structures that support our bullish momentum. Now, with this demand level identified, we can clearly see um, a reversal structure around this area, which um which actually supported that breakout of of structure with um let me give this a orange color so that it's good we could okay good so we had a key level around this area that's 0.73900 which is also a very strong psychological level so let me give this a purple so that we're different from okay so we have this we have a strong psychological level around here and with that level we with that level there um breakout of structure happened earlier this morning and this was a signal for it for a trend continuation to the upside so with this signal we want to look for confirmations in the form of a retracement into that key level somewhere into that key level before price actually move to the upside. However, it is very possible that price does not do that because of the tendency of, of this strong bullish momentum. So what we want to be looking for is being in this trade right above that key level. The key level we identified on daily time frame where we saw 
um, significant um, resistance and support of that area in the past. So somewhere around above this key level will be a good area for us to take advantage of this trade. And I will also have the position at this point where we'll be looking for a take profit target at somewhere around give me a moment we want to we want to look at what's happening on so we have a structure around here where we had um, um, a resistant level which is also which also can be called the supply zone so we want to be looking at this level for um, our take profit target because that level has um, a strong momentum for bearish tendencies so i think we should place our take profit target around here let's, let's say 850 there about and that's around um, 150 pips profit so with this regard we want to move our stop loss to the neckline area right below the neckline area, that's around 50 pips so we have a risk reward of from one to one to three for those who are just joining now so i would like to pause the video at this point in time and let's see how price action reacts remember this key level remains our guide into taking a trade at this juncture on the market so let's see how price reacts as price action is being monitored um i will always i will always try as much as possible to give an update of this trade in the comment section below on my trading view account Thank you and do have a wonderful day.